Okay, well it rains outside on this rainy hot night. I'm gonna take apart a speaker. Oh look, you can see me reflected in the window. Hello. Okay. It's a crappy little dual brand speaker here. I've got many of these. I'm gonna build myself later on, I'm gonna build myself some proper speakers. Here's one of the woofers, which I salvaged out of a pair of thrown out speakers. Got the other one elsewhere. I've got many of these. Don't have any tweeters, but these do have a good high frequency response. So I'm going to take the speakers out of these because I never used them. I'm going to use these as the tweeters. Now I've removed all the screws out of the back. And the thing just does not want to come apart. So I'm going to try to see if I can prise off the grill here, see if that can see if that will come off. Oh, here it comes. Okay. Now, oh, this is not very good. Don't know if you can make that out, but this has got a foam surround. So I'm not going to pump any bass into this. Well, I'm not going to do that anyway, considering I'm using it as a tweeter, but... Yeah, let's um, take this apart now. Using all reliable hair. Oh, there we go, speaker's coming out now. Hmm, appears to have a pretty good size magnet on it. Looks looks like a shielded magnet to me. Yep, that's definitely shielded. Oh, the case is coming apart now. Oh, yes, yeah, so you can see there was extra screw parts in there holding it. The speaker was the only thing that was holding that in. Alright then. Well, because of the foam and rubber surround, I'm not going to use this as a full range speaker. But I think it will be pretty good to use as a tweeter. Okay, there we go. I now have the woofers and the tweeters. Now, to see if I can get some wood and other stuff and build myself a decent pair of speakers.